Uh, Sapphire Stakes at 255 has actually been a decent uh, trial for the Nunthorpe, um, the likes of Mechas Angel and Marsha winning it recently. Your thoughts on this, Jeno? I thought Maps Cross would win. It's boring, um, but best form in the book. It's now rated, it's rated up, up on 110 now, and uh, thought it was a good run at Royal Ascot. It's, it, it's a funny, I don't like backing short prices in sprints at the Curra for no real well, reason. Me, well, Mecca's Angel got beaten, Marsha got beaten. Yeah, I just, <laughs> it, there, is a, there is a recurring theme there, but they're, they're not really hard luck stories. It's just certain horses don't seem to handle the track, but Babs Cross, you'd imagine, should be fine, and uh, yeah, I'd say it'll win. Johnny? Uh, not a betting race for me. I'm surprised Ryan Moore is riding Battle of Jericho. I thought he'd ride Washington, D.C., you know, that could be a negative in the sense of chrono the chronological order or whatever, or the pecking order, but at least you might get a better price in Dunnick's Mount Washington to see. He's very solid in fairness. Yeah, he's solid this winter. Yeah, he's, you'd imagine Caspian Prince will be up there. He'll get a toe off him. They've a little bit, he's a little bit fine at the weights with him, but he's won. I remember him winning at the Curl last year when I was there. He's, he's solid, like he should run a good race. Right, let's move on to the Cowboy Stakes.